there is a long tradition on the part of the Catholic Church to be involved with service to the poor and to the groups that are more vulnerable in society. And this attention has been increasing as the situation of a global world is becoming more evident. Pope Francis has insisted to create a mentality of inclusion, to build bridges and not to build walls, to communicate, to be open and to welcome and to assist everybody who is in need. This concern is evident in the encyclical Laudato Si, where the emphasis has been placed on the fact that everything is joined together. And since we are united, we are one family of God as human beings, and have a responsibility for creation, then we must work in a collaborative form. Today, problems cannot be solved in isolation. And the example of the present pandemic of coronavirus shows that one country or it cannot by itself come to a solution of this problem. We need to collaborate to look for a joint effort so to make this world a little better. The Global Solidarity Fund is an effort to meet this global perspective, this series of problems that have to be addressed in a joint and collective form. The Global Solidarity Fund made up of people of goodwill who have uh, the foundations, uh, other individuals, even philanthropists and business people, is trying to change the world by providing resources that impact through the projects that are supported. I am very happy to be associated in a small way with this effort of making our common home a home that is welcoming, that is friendly, that is attentive to everybody. It does not exclude anyone, but it tries to reach out and serve as many people as possible.